What's going on guys, Gitchy1230 here with more Grand Theft Auto 5, and today what I want to talk to you guys about are the changes that you might be able to expect with patch 1.12. There are a lot of big rumors circulating about this patch, this might be the big one, this might bring us some good changes, and possibly even heists. So that is what we're going to be talking about today, but before we get into that, I just want to let you know that I am giving away a free copy of Titanfall to one of my lucky subscribers, courtesy of Leap Trade, the best way to trade video games with other gamers and get new games in your hands. And uh, basically the steps to enter are down in the description description below, there are only four easy things that you need to do, and once you do those, hey, you're interested in a chance to win a free copy of Titanfall, so why not? And lastly, hit the like button on this video if you like what I'm doing, or hit the dislike button if you don't, but make sure you tell me why in the comments below, but without any further ado, why don't we get into this discussion? So one of the most exciting things that I think that we will be able to expect with patch 1.12, or possibly 1.13, if it's not this one, I think it'll be the next one, but it's the addition of more garages and more apartments. I think this is going to be an awesome addition, and I do think that this updates coming. Uh, if you didn't see my previous video about this, then you might be hearing this and saying, well, what makes you believe that? Rockstar hasn't told us anything about that. Well, one thing is that uh, if you bring up your quick menu in Grand Theft Auto Online, you can actually see that the home option is gone. As I said in that video, uh, the home option was changed to the name of your apartment. And why else would they change it to the name of your specific apartment? Well, probably because they're adding more apartments and they need a way to differentiate between them. So uh, that is the first thing that led me to believe that they may be adding more garages. Because at this point, I think that Rockstar is finally realizing that we can't we, we can't function with a 10-car garage anymore. It's, it's just way too hard. Because, you know, you want to keep your off-road vehicles, you want to keep your street racing vehicles, your supercars, your sports cars, and then besides that, you want the DLC cars. And Rockstar, I think, realizes that we can't function with a 10-car garage anymore. It's just too difficult. There are too many awesome cars out there. And uh, we're having to get rid of ones that we really like and replace them with, you know, something that we kind of want. So, I don't know. It's it's just not working, and I think Rockstar has finally uh, come to realize that. And for that reason, they are going to be making it so we can add more than one garage, uh, if not two or three. Uh, personally, I think that three might be the limit. Hopefully, there's no limit, though. Hopefully, we can have hundreds of cars, but I kind of doubt that. And as far as apartments go, I'm actually curious to see how that's going to work. Because, you know, obviously, more garages has a direct function, so we can own more cars. But uh, what's the true purpose of having more than one apartment? There probably really isn't one, so I imagine that when you buy a new apartment that comes with a garage, it's just going to be like a, uh, another alternative to where you can go to sleep or do whatever else you do in your normal apartment. It'll just be uh, pretty much the same thing as your first apartment. I don't think that there, you'll be able to really do anything new by having two apartments, but that is just my opinion. And then the second big thing that uh, people are really hoping for with patch 1.12 might officially be the introduction of heists. I know there's some rumors circulating about this, and people are really hoping that this is going to be the golden patch. This is going to be the one that brings heists to us months and months after the game was released. I know that Rockstar initially promised these pretty early and they kept getting delayed, uh, probably due to hackers and modders and glitches and things like that, but at this point we're all pretty much waiting to see them and we still don't have them. So will patch 1.12 be the one that introduces heists finally? Well, I, 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 uh, I don't know. It's hard to say on this one because I feel like when they come out, or when they're about to come out anyway, Rockstar is going to want to talk about that. Uh, they're going to want to advertise that and finally say, you know, get ready for heists coming next week or in two weeks. So... I guess that doesn't rule out the possibility, it's still very possible, because at this point, the heists are so close. They've been slowly adding little details that are almost like teasers for us. They, It's almost kind of cruel in a way. They keep adding these little hints that are like, yeah, heists are coming, they're on the way, but we're not going to quite put them out yet, so... Uh, I think that Rockstar is very close. I mean, the heist went into beta even a month or two ago, and uh, I feel like they've had enough time to test this and everything, so... I do kind of feel like Heist 3.1, or <laughs> not 3, Heist 1.12 will be the addition of the multiple garages and heists, but I would also understand if Rockstar didn't want to add too many good things at once. You know, maybe they want to space these out a little bit, maybe they want heists to be in 1.12 and the multiple garages to be in 1.13, or vice versa. I would totally understand if they just, you know, didn't want to bombard us with too many good things at once, because they want to space out the good updates, obviously. So uh, with that, I would love to know what you guys thing in the comments below. What do you think we can expect in patch 1.12? And are these changes that you want? Do you think we will see multiple garages? I'd love to know what you guys think. And with that, please stay tuned for more videos in the future. I will see you next time.